Good morning. How are you doing? No, really, how are you doing? I, I was really struck um, that what I should talk about this morning is how are we doing? You know, the amount of times that uh, people will say, hi, how are you? And I just kind of go, I'm fine, you know, even though it's been the worst day ever. Um, and, you know, not that we want to be splurging on everyone and saying, you know, this is how everything is at the moment when um, actually they, they, weren't, they weren't really asking how you were. It was just kind of like a, a bit of a, a greeting. Um, but actually, God wants to know how we're doing. He wants to know how we're feeling. And even though he might already know, you know, he wants us to express it to him. And uh, just as a, a parent would want with a child to be able to talk about um, how they're doing, how they're feeling, about how it really is and not just putting a mask on it. And so um, how are you doing? How are you doing this morning? Maybe you're feeling really happy, really good, really grateful to God for a whole load of things. Maybe you're, uh, you've had a really tough week and you're just exhausted and you don't even know how you feel. It's just exhausted. Maybe you've had, um, you know, maybe you're really struggling still with the, uh, having to work and do kids and all sorts of things that, that are just going on at the moment. But do you know what? God really wants to know how it's going for us. He really wants us to express that to him. And so let's just take a moment this morning to stop and say, how am I doing? How, how are things? Maybe you, you put it on a scale, you know, how much out of 10 or whatever, or um, maybe you're someone who would write things and write it down and, and uh, then be able to offer it over to God. But the important thing is acknowledge it, acknowledge how you're doing today and then pass it over to Jesus, give it over to God and that's a really good way just to start our days is to to acknowledge how things really are not pretend not sweep it under the carpet and then to allow god by his holy spirit to minister to us so holy spirit we just ask now as we come to you and uh, just have that sense of you saying how are you lord thank you that you really do care you really do want to know and holy spirit we just say would you come right now to each one of us and would you minister to us would you go to the depths of who we really are and um would you refresh us would you rejuvenate us would you restore us lord and would you enable us and equip us for all that's going to happen today amen Later on today, as it's Sunday, um, I was just saying that for those of us who um, struggle to know what day of the week it is, let alone the date, and uh, often struggle with the year at the moment, although 2020 is going to be quite a memorable year, I think. Um, but later on this morning, we have our service starting at 10.20. Can I encourage you, whether you have children or not, to start at 10.20? Um, because I think that the family times at the very beginning have been... Um, really helpful in terms of explaining and setting the scene for the whole morning. So 10.20 this morning, look forward to kind of virtually seeing you then. Bye for now.